Yeah, I can tell. Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm Nicole from Aphrodisiac Theatre News, and I'm here with Heather and Tossin from Shifters. Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, guys? I'm great. Yeah. Really good. Very excited. So I was um, pleased to see you both doing the play at Shepherd's Bush in the smaller theatre. I noticed that the set is similar. Yeah. How, how does it feel? Is it similar? Different. I mean, di similar because obviously it's like me and Heather are doing it. Obviously, the lighting is still the same, the stage is still the same. Um, but everything's tweaked just a bit. You know, yeah. lines have changed just a bit. I did wonder. Yeah. yeah. Is that deliberate because of a change of audience, perhaps? Of, uh, I think it's just sight ends and stuff like that. So obviously, we've got to adapt to, to the theatre and where we're at. Um, Everything's still much the same, just little tweaks here and there, mm. like little lines here and there, little words here and there, a couple of music changes. Um, performance is still somewhat the same, but obviously, like, we ain't done it in like four or five months, so yeah. obviously, I think we've grown as artists and as people, and so I think things just changed just a slight bit. Mm. Okay. But I think that's like with anything, everything over time just evolves and develops into something different even though it's the same thing how different it felt to performing it in a smaller because it's 700 theater. people right yeah, so um, there's a hell of a lot more people so i think it's also we're trying to like this understanding of before we were in traverse but now mm. we're looking up and down and side so it's also trying to um with in previews right now and it's also trying to keep everyone engaged and making mm. sure that we're everyone is involved so it still has that like level of intimacy we had mm. at the bush yeah. and that's the thing that we really want to try to keep mm. so yeah hopefully we're we're getting there Okay, so Heather, I wondered how much of yourself do you put into your role? Oh gosh, not really that much. I think um, we have a drama therapist called Rabria King who I mm. worked with on a lot of my shows and she's very good at separating the character from you. So it definitely feels like you're putting on a character, you're being that character and you're taking it off. So it feels really separate and, and I think it allows the work to be safe and also really enjoyable. Mm. Um, so there's things about she's an artist and she's creative but um, there's a lot of things which I haven't experienced before, but Rubria has been really fantastic. At, um, she calls this the character village of making it really solid. So it feels safe and enjoyable to play. Okay. And Tosin, same question to you. How much of yourself do you put into your characters? I try not to put myself into um, the characters. Obviously like your own personal experiences and other people's personal experiences you see and you might identify with a character. Mm -hmm. But I think I just use that to buy identifying certain things. Or mm. if I don't identify, it's like, okay, cool, like, what is it? And I try and just to, you know, elaborate with their feelings and their stories and, and, and their feelings and just try and make it their own and just expand on that. And once I can kind of understand that, or I've got a good sense of that, I just try and just tap into that rather than my own personal experience. Mm. Okay. Because it'd be a bit too heavy. Mm. <laughs> I mean, it's like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Before I used to do that, and it's just not sustainable. Mm. And I feel like it's more creative when you find new ways of telling new emotions or familiar emotions, and you're doing it in a way that's not yours. Yeah. Okay. It's all fresh. Have either of you been in a West End production before? No, oh, this is our debut. Yeah, my debut. Yeah. yeah. Excited? I, yeah. <sighs> Is it? Why? You've been at the West End? I think so. It's the first no time I've seen those classes. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. forget him then. Yeah. What was that? <laughs> I didn't even want to mention the play. I didn't like the play. So oh, I'm, dear. Uh, yeah. Okay. This is the debut then. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, um, we're very pleased for you and we hope that it goes really well. How have the pre -pre previews gone it's so far? Well, man. Really yeah. well. Literally, yeah. we're rocking. <laughs> yeah, our audiences are just incredible. They're so yeah. verbal. It really feels like yeah. an immersive, like, yeah. um, like an experience, in it? Yeah. So it's a bigger version of the crowded bush. Yeah. yeah. Good. Good, so forgive me for this, I have to get a Supercell question in oh, yeah, because, you know, being the man of the moment, <laughs> they will kill me if I don't ask. <laughs> Series 2 yeah. is coming. Yeah, 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 What's yeah. happening? Tell us everything. Tell us the plot. You Spill. Don't Spill. Yeah, yeah, right. I don't know yet. I'm still kind of brainstorming and, you know, trying to piece, piece it together. And... Also, can yeah. I just say, Tosin is incredible in Supercell and it's such an important show, so it just feels brilliant to like celebrate the show with Tossin right now. He's, yeah, stunning in it. Yeah. Do you think um, a lot of the Shifters audience is coming because of 
think, watching uh, Super Sour Patch. I think, uh, I think they're coming because they want to see the show. I think they heard so much good stuff about the show the last time. And they love Benny. But also, Benny's writing, like, the, 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 her writing is incredible. So I do want to. Yeah, so I, think, I think everyone plays a major part and I think it's just like a synergy of what we're just creating and what we're doing and people just love it so they want to see what's going on so you know it all helps it all comes together mm -hmm. good thank you very much thank congratulations you. and good luck